Ma, 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 what it do, Roski? It's your main man, Davey, Matt Fly, two eyes, man, back in the mob museum with a whole nother banger, Roski. You know what I'm saying? Hey, I'm almost able to rock that bit with two on, you know what I'm saying? Hey, I'm getting back right, man. But hell yeah, look. Let me give a shout out to all my OGs, youngest, day ones, and new members alike, Broski. You know what I'm saying? Everybody don't like what we got going on over here, so we got some rules for that. Rule number one. You know what I'm saying? My camera, my channel, upload what I want to whenever I feel like it. Rule number two. You know what I'm saying? Hey, this shit called YouTube. Be you on the tube, bro. Nothing more than that list. And rule number three, if you don't like what you see, get the fuck on. Bitch! You know what I'm saying? But anyway, <laughs> man, how y'all day going, bro? I was having a fire day, you know what I'm saying? Day going pretty smooth. Got a uh, Rooster Man head done, bro, that shit. Bro, that shit was a headache. <laughs> I ain't gonna fake, bro. I'm telling you, that shit was a headache for real, for real. But, got that shit done. Um, Everything been going pretty smooth, man, so far. I holler at the Lights guy, man. Told that boy to chill out, man. You know what I'm saying? Hey, Lights guy finna come on that motherfucker tripping here soon, man. But, hey, I, I holler at him. Told that boy to chill out, man. Everything gonna be cool. You know what I'm saying? I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't gonna be no problems. I ain't gonna be no problems, I promise. On my end, at least. But look, though, bro, all that bullshit out of the way. Check this out, man. I know YouTubers, well, sneaker YouTubers, you know what I'm saying? Love holding each other accountable, bro. Somebody fuck up and sneak a YouTube, trust me. You're gonna find out about it. You're gonna know about it. It don't matter if you subscribe to the nigga or not. Like, you know what I'm saying? This. That's just the state that we in. Everybody motherfucking deputy dick running around with their flashlights out trying to call a nigga out. But I wonder who all gonna say something about how motherfucking uh complex and how uh flight club just robbed that boy little Nas X. Like, cool, that shit all the way fucking ridiculous. Like they 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 real life robbed this man now. I ain't bullshitting, say what you wanna say, you don't get no fuck about it. Like I ain't I'ma call this shit how I see it on my channel. They raw that man, bro. I ain't even playing. If you don't watch sneaker shopping, pretty much what they do, you know what I'm saying? They take the celebrities, whoever hot at the time, you know what I mean? Take the motherfucking sneaker shopping. It's self-explanatory, you know what I'm saying? They either go to a flight club or whatever these, one of these motherfucking super pricey ass consignment shops. You know what I'm saying? Folks come in there, they tell the story. Oh, I only had one, two pair of shoes growing up. I ain't had shit growing up. Now I got all this money, I'm finna spend it all in the stove type shit. Like, that's pretty much the premise of the fucking show. You know what I mean? Celebrities come on, they tell about their sneaker history. If they, if it is any, in most cases, it's not. Like, them motherfuckers don't be giving a damn about their shoes. Don't be knowing shit about the shoes. But it get big ass views for Complex, so they continue to do the shit. Bam, the little dude, Lil Nas X. I'm gonna take my horse on that song, you know what I'm saying? I'm got them horses in the back. That mo you know what the fuck I'm talking about, cuz. Lil Nas X, right? Got the song, the remix with Billy Ray, motherfucker going crazy on top of charts, all that shit. Boom, 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 boom. He's on the show today. And if you haven't seen the episode yet, please, after you watch this, go check that shit out, bro. If you a sneakerhead and you understand the sneaker market, not even if you a sneaky head. I'ma walk you through this shit so you can know and see for yourself. This some, you ain't even gotta be a sneaky head to see. This some motherfucking bullshit we're going on right here, bro. Anyway, you know what I'm saying? Dude told the story. Yeah, I only had one, two shoes per year growing up. Blah, 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 blah. Fast forward, he started buying his own shoes in high school. Blah, 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 blah. Don't nobody give a fuck about none of that. Come time for him to pick out the shoes, right? Boom, first shoe he grabbed. Off white UNC ones. I'm like, okay, you know what I'm saying? I fucks with it, fee. Next, shoe he grab the motherfucking orange peel Gatorade ones. The, the Gatorade, the orange Gatorade ones. I'm like, all right, you know what I'm saying? Maybe he missed, I don't know. He went into the shits. I fuck with the shoe myself. Last shoe he grabbed, black and yellow mellow 13. Nothing wrong with that shoe, you know what I'm saying? That ended up at outlets because of defects. Um, People were getting them for fucking ridiculous prices, like the love prices, you know what I'm saying? Hey, so all that all good, I'm watching the shit, I'm like, okay, all right, straight little haul, you know what I'm saying? He ain't, he ain't making no noise, but goddamn straight little haul, whatever. I'm about to turn the motherfucking phone off, they go to ringing up shoes, I'm walking away. 
Something made me look back, bro. And once I seen how much they charged him for these goddamn orange Gatorades, nigga, I almost lost my shit, bro. Look at the screenshot, man. Y'all see this shit? <laughs> Come on, cuz. Like, nigga, I don't know one, I don't, what, clearly the boy's not a sneakhead, so, you know what I'm saying? We ain't, we ain't gonna charge him up about that, but my nigga, I don't give a damn. I don't know one person, one sneakerhead, one, one anybody who understands the sneaker market or even know how to download StockX or got StockX on their phone who would have paid that much for that motherfucking shoe, man. It's over 300. They charge that man over 300 for that shoe, boy. I'm like, cuz they damn near charge that man 200 for the old mellow. They charge him like 190. I understand it's a consignment store, so they gotta put a little bit on top of it to make that bread. Like, I ain't even tripping on the mellow. Look at the price of these goddamn orange Gatorades, cuz. I'm thinking this man what like, I'm thinking he got to weigh like what, 12? Size 12, 13, whatever. You know what I mean? True, all right. I don't know, over time, y'all let me know in the comment box if, you know what I'm saying, prices just be fluctuating and shooting up like that. Cause if that's the case, nigga, every goddamn shoe, I buy them from the double up and get the double in a size 13 and hold on that bitch and sit on to it. They charge this man $300 for the orange peel Gatorade, bro. I went on stock X. My size ain't even going 150 on that bitch. The the upper size, I think the, the most expensive one I seen on this motherfucker was what? Like 280 something? Know what I mean? And that's the, nobody's gonna pay that for that shoe, bruh. Come on, cuz y'all motherfuckers out here tripping with no map, bruh. Y'all nigga tripping like your shoes tied, cuz. Together, like. Both shoes tied together. Y'all nigga tripping real, real hard out this motherfucker, cuz. And some, man, I'm telling you. Look, honest to God, true, bro. I don't be even no fuck with none of these niggas doing out here. Ain't none of my problem. I don't, bro, at this point, I really care. I don't care to help. I don't, look, man, you better get your shit, get it out the mud like I had to get it. And like I'm trying to get it and continuing to. You know what I'm saying? That's why I always get that shout out to all my OG youngest day one new members of life, bro. Because y'all ain't got to hit the subscribe and fuck with me. But, bro, I'm telling y'all straight up, like, not now, one of you piss pussy ass YouTubers better not say nothing to me if y'all ain't got nothing to say about how Flight Club and motherfucking complex and robbing these folks out here, robbing these celebrities because they don't know the marketing shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm blaming complex too here. They getting money, they getting crazy motherfucking views out for the shit. The shoe stores eating because these dumb ass folks going there paying these outrageous prices. Like, I understand this flight club, they been in the business so many years, da 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 all that, but man, look, man, I ain't nobody finna pay no goddamn 300 for the orange pill Gatorade one, well, fuck out of here, bro. Y'all niggas tripping, 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 and not now one of you motherfuckers shoot too, and I say shit to me, cuz y'all ain't got nothing to say about this shit, cuz this shit is out of control. Y'all niggas love to motherfucking talk shit about each other all goddamn day long for weeks at a time. Some shit happen like this, it's just like, man, fuck it, what else? You know what I'm saying? Y'all motherfuckers, man. <laughs> Mob, I forgot to say mob. Peace, my my fan of yours, bro. My day, bitch. Mob, mob, wet 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 mob.